Knives are wonderful tools to be able to do all sorts of necessary things to survive and thrive in the woodland. Um, we're going to be looking at different kinds of knives for different age groups and how to use them safely. Um, you might notice there are numbers on my knives. So I like to number my knives. I like to make sure I know who's using the knives when. This is more important if you're working with a, uh, a group that has more vulnerabilities or challenges. So you need to be really accountable for where your knives are. Um, you've not seen my knives in a box yet, but all my knives are kept in a box. Normally that's a locked box. Again, it depends on my relationship with those groups and how long I've known them as to whether I think it's perfectly safe to have a box that's open or whether I need to lock my box. Often what we'll do is we'll get the group to sit down um, and check, first of all, their space, how much space there is between them and another person. And that's one of the first things we do. We won't actually give them knives out until we've actually got them sit seated properly. We want to be thinking about in terms of all this sort of work with tools is are they listening to instructions for example we don't want to be handing out knives if they're not listening and paying attention you also don't want to be handing out knives if it's late at night for example and they're tired so think it's common sense